Hello world, lock picking dev here. Today I have an ace padlock. It is 5202767. Very similar to the one and three quarters of an inch padlock as well. Except for this one just has a little bit less tolerance on the cutting. Uh, same four pins and a little, little bit more pry resistance on the bigger one. Anyways, we're going to try to unbox this real quick. Get it open. There we go. I think I'm gonna make these boxes a pain in the ass to open. There we go. And the background there is actually the Tetons. Let me get the zoom here in just a second. And here we go. It's a nice little weather resistant lock here. So you've got a cover on the bottom. Open it up. It is four pins. It looks like a, uh, oh wow, it looks like a, uh, Master lock keyway almost. Ones that they use on um, their little combination locks. Anyways, uh, here we go. The last ace I picked had some security pins in it. I'm not sure if this one will. Let's see here. I need to add a little bit more tension here. Make sure my tool's not getting stuck on that cover there. There we go. It's like two. Yeah. Three. One. There's our open. There's our open. Right out of the box. Our bedding is, let's see, right there. So, yeah, decent bedding. Uh, it's not guttable, not too surprised, extremely small lock. Anyways, look in the back here, we're at Bitch Creek in uh, Idaho, and we've got a nice view of the Tetons as well, way back there. You can just see them poking out of the clouds, it looks gorgeous right now. And that range goes all along right there. And then down here, we're actually at Bitch Creek, which is more like a bitch river because <laughs> it's not a creek. So, yeah, very freaking gorgeous. Nice down this big old ravine right here. And this is in Idaho. All right, that was Bitch Creek slash river. Down there's the Grand Teton, that is the Grand Teton right there. And this was an Ace Weatherproof Padlock, model 5202767. Again, same exact uh, feel for the one and three quarters, just a little bit tougher on the prying and cutting. All right, everyone, thanks for watching.